says. Nostalgic. So, like, old-fashioned, like what my mom and dad used to see when they were kids. So, I have a lot of stuff here. So, first off, let's try the Zots. Actually, I'm just going to tell you what I have so far. I have original New York seltzer, which is like a soda, and then I have another soda, which is cherry limeade soda. And then I have Zots, as of course, like I just told you about. And I have Fifth Avenue. And then I have cigarette candy. I have mallow cups. I have Chico stick. I have sixlets. And I have lights. So, first off, I'm going to try Zots, because they're good. I've had them before, except not cherry flavor. So, let's eat one. I can even get them out of the container. I'm not sure if I've had, actually eaten Zots before. But, let's get one out. They're like, they look like this. It definitely tastes fruit. A little sour. I like them a lot. Oh, sticky. Oh, 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 oh. Fizzy middle. Hmm. Mm hmm. I have way fizzy middle, so I can tell you that much. Good though. Alright. Let's open the container for the next one. The next one is Fifth Avenue chocolate bar. So, this is like, it's crunchy peanut butter and a rich chocolate coating, it says right here. So, I like that. It's lots of good. Alright. Fifth Avenue. So, crunchy peanut butter and rich chocolate coating. I can already smell it. It smells like peanut butter. Ooh, whoa. It's very crunchy. I'll show you what the inside looks like. Whoa. That peanut. Oh, it says crunchy peanut butter. That is good. It's like. I can definitely taste the peanut butter, and it's like milk chocolate outside. Yeah. It's pretty damn good. So, next, I think we should do the mallow cup. It's like, it says whipped cream center. And chocolate on the outside. It looks like a Reese's. I think that's pretty much a Reese's, except not like Reese's in the middle. It's like marshmallow cream or whipped cream. So, yeah, the, the last one is pretty good too. Alright, I've already got a scene of what they look like. What the? These things are big. Oh gosh. Oh. Is there anything under them? No. I have to. Oh gosh, my wrapper is stuck to it. Because some of the whipping cream fell out. Oh gosh. Pull, 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 pull. Oh, now there's a wrapper on it. As you can see here, some of the whipping cream and marshmallow kind of spilled up into the top. Oh gosh, oh no. I dropped a little tiny piece of the wrapper. Alright, so this could be really good. I've never tried one. So, just pulling it out of this wrapper, like in Reese's wrapper. And some of it spilled onto the bottom too. Alright. I 
can tell it's dark chocolate. So tiny bit of coconut. No, I think it's just dark chocolate with a marshmallow filling. Yeah, that's marshmallow filling. It's good. Oh gosh, I got chocolate all over my face. Mmm. Yeah, it's definitely dark chocolate. It's definitely has a marshmallow coating in the inside, or whipping cream, but it's it's kind of hard. Oh, there we go. No, oh, um, no, it's soft. Yeah, inside's not whipping cream. It's marshmallow. This is good. Yeah, 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 oh, 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 oh
Dang good. I like. Okay. I can't believe I still couldn't open this. Like seriously. I don't know how to open that thing. Alright, I'm just gonna finish up this tiny bite here of my marshmallow thing that I had before. The mallow cup. Mm -hmm. Alright, next I'm gonna be doing the wraps. Alright, so. I'm trying to open it. Okay, there we go. Mm-hmm. I think I'll try to open it a little bit more. Okay. I've got three so far. I've got a banana. I've got like an orange and a grape. I'm gonna try the banana first. What do you want? Banana? Oh, it's hard. It's banana y. Gosh. It's got a crunch. It kinda hurts. A little bit. <laughs> yeah, so I think we're supposed to take, like, taste like the fruit they are. They're definitely fruity. They're good. Good. Yeah, the purple scrape. Yeah, these are good. Um. Nothing else to say about them. They're hard, fruity, crunchy, hard. Yeah. All right. What should I do next? I have the choice of Chico stick or Sixlets. I think I'm gonna do the Chico stick first. It's crunchy peanut butter and toasted coconut candy. That's a mouthful. Whoa. Looks like there's little crunchy things on it. I think those are cut coconut. It's like an orange. Let's try it. Oh, whoa! Whoa. 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 Whoa, whoa, whoa. That was crunchier than I thought it was going to be. They're really crunchy. It's definitely a peanut butter you. I'm not really getting that much coconut though. Yeah. Not a lot of coconut. But, I can tell you this much. It's crunchy, peanut buttery, and a tiny bit coconutty. And now I have another bottle cap to get to my collection. And come. That is good. Next, let's do six lights. I don't know how good these are going to be. Bad. Don't know. Um, is this supposed to be instructions on how you open these? Because this is not easy. My fingers. How do you open them? Um. One. Six lits. 
How are you supposed to open dang six lits? The six lits is not working out for me. I'm sorry, six lits, six lits. Come on, six lits. Do your thing. They're chocolatey candies. I don't think chocolatey is a word. Should have gotten scissors. I will be right back, okay? Right back. Alright guys, I'm back. Got some scissors. To open these six lits. Six lits, so because hopefully. Yep, it came out. Alright, I did it. They're milk chocolate. They're kind of strange. They kind of taste like hot cocoa for some reason. <clears throat> I don't know if that's just me, but they're not bad. I like them. They're chocolatey. They're kind of cr they're kind of like M and M's, except kind of better. I have to say. All right. Now on to the one before the last finale. A cigarette candy. So, it's kind of like go a good way. Or bad way. No. Swish out my mouth a little bit. Come on, cigarette pack open or cigarette candy pack. No. Here we go. One out. Oh my goodness. Come on. Ready? So I hear a story supposed to do it the other way. You have to push it out a little bit. Push it in a little bit. Uh, I don't know what's going on. Where's the little pack? All of them. They're supposed to like. I do not know, but under here is bubble gum, so I don't know if I did that wrong, if I'm supposed to do it some way, other way, some other way, but it just did not work out, so 
Little lady put it there. See where Kate is. Sure. Look at that. Ball girl came out. Supposed to be blowing. I don't know if I'm supposed to be blowing there. That's like a place I was supposed to. I don't know. I like the candy though. So, I just have to figure out a way to open the bottle. Swallow that hole. But it looks like a fail sink. So I'm gonna I, I'm gonna go get some help to open this bottle. I'll be back in a second. All right, I'm back with an opened New York seltzer can. So let's o let's open this and try it. It's root beer flavored. Oh, that's a weird flavor, but I I really like it. I've actually never had beer flavor like that. Like, it, it, it tastes like root beer. It kind of tastes like a different type of root beer. Or it just might be because I have eaten all these. Yeah, it's, it's root beer. I mean, well, it's, it's good. So... You know, it's good. Also, I really like these. These are really cool. And I actually tried one more off camera, and they actually do work. So, if you guys enjoyed this nostalgic candy taste test, leave a like, subscribe, comment to see what we want to game, what, what, what game you want me to play next. And, well, bye!